Hello Scorpio and welcome to your coffee cup reading for the week ahead of March 25th through the 31st. Plate is quite interesting. We'll get to that. Okay. Hmm. Scorpio. Scorpio, Scorpio. Keep in mind it's a general reading, but I do see new experiences, new people coming through. Um you, overall, a lot of you have this exciting type of energy happening too. Um, it's like you're excited about something. I do see some of you are keeping some secrets or you're kind of, um, it's a sense of investigation, uh, research for some of you. Now, like I said, this, it's a general reading. So let me try to explain what I'm seeing is either some of you, this could be someone, some of you getting a job, um, where you're doing a lot of research forensics, maybe you become a private eye, um, or you just do some kind of research, background checks, something like that. Some of you may actually hire a private detective or something for some kind of research. I'm seeing that. Now, for others, it could be also that someone's spying on you, okay? It's kind of that energy, but a lot of you, this could be also you just like, researching, checking into someone's background, uh, stalking their <laughs> Facebook, um, social media or something because you're trying to find some answers or that. Um, that's the energy I'm seeing. And again, it's like it is a general reading. So um, that's what I'm definitely I'm seeing, though. It's for someone out there. Um, it's like this James Bond um, energy, 007. Yeah, give me a martini and get it over and done with <laughs> Or Columbo. I don't know if any of you knows Columbo. I used to love watching that show. He was my favorite. But I just see that kind of energy. Wow, Scorpio. I don't know. Love you guys anyway. So. <laughs> there is a sense of mystery, um, intrigue, uh, something like that going on too. There's even a sensual side too. So this could be connected to love for a lot of things. So like I said, it is a general reading. Um, let your intuition guide you. It's very strong, okay? You're keeping a lot to yourself. You're very, you're quite mysterious, too. There are other um, others around you kind of find you very intriguing, mysterious, um, even sensual, okay? You're attracting also if it's got to do with love or just if you're dating. Um, there's a sensual side of you that's showing up, okay? So that is for some of you out there, too. For some, um, if this could be you're dealing with an authority figure or you're dealing with a father or some dominant male too, truths will be revealed from what I'm seeing here, okay? So that's a strong message for some of you. You have very strong energy. You definitely got that strength and mm, to get through this week, even though there is some energy here where to me it's showing more that you need to get some rest. It's like maybe you're not sleeping enough. Okay, insomnia is coming up, but I do see that it could be worry, stress, depends, you know, it's a general reading, but I do see that energy as well. Okay, I do see some kind of sense of exposure, so um, something's going to come to light. I do see very nice, uh, fun energy, adventurous type of energy coming through too. Um, I do see um, a goal, a wish, a hope, a desire, a very strong desire for some of you. Um, it's on its way, okay? It's like you're on the right path, so to speak, with that. So that came through really strongly, too. It's like you you have this secret side or something. It's like something maybe you've been hiding, keeping, I don't know. Uh, maybe you've been keeping a log or you're keeping records of something, too, to prove something. You know, I'm just seeing that kind of energy showing up. Um, I do see a lot of, uh, fantasizing, fantasy, mystery, um, also a lot of your hidden talents. It's like some people maybe underestimated you. It's like you may have some talents, skills, and you kind of, you don't brag about it. You don't talk about it. And some people may be underestimating you. That's another thing I'm seeing as well. Um, I do see also dealing with some practical issues too is very important. Now, um, the stress could be also showing up here because I see health is on your mind. Also work, work and health together are on your mind as well. Um, and also there could be a person coming in. This could be a friend or someone that you know. 
Um, it's a person that you know that may need your help or your or need help from you somehow as well. Transformative energy is coming through. It's more like a sword I'm seeing here too. So troops being revealed. Very powerful energy coming up as well. Okay, so that is showing up. Um, I do see these these situations um, coming up, but you know, diplomatic um, energy is coming up. It's very important to be very diplomatic this week, okay? Very bold energy you have here too. Um, genius type of energy too, so hmm, very interesting. You've got a lot of powerful um, energy showing up in the, in the cup this week, so it's really quite interesting. I do see like magic type of energy. Um, some of you could be like very flighty this week. Um, there's a sense of sensual sexiness. I don't know. Um, for if you're a man, you may be attracted to a, a very attractive female this week too. She kind of like catches your eye. That's another way I'm seeing this too. So it's really um, interesting energy here. It's like flighty type of energy too. So, wow. I don't know how else to explain it. <laughs> okay. Now on the plate, again, I'm seeing that energy there too. Okay. Health, well-being is showing up. This could be, you know, you just, it's on your mind or you're concerned. Some stressful energies here too, but the, the way I'm seeing it more is these are like secrets or things um, around you too. So that is showing up as well. Um, I do see a, this is a new love or an interest in a new love or a renewal of love for some of you too. Uh, very maternal energy too. There is a lot of feminine energy too. So you could be dealing with females this week. Now, again, I'm seeing two ways here. Either the, um, this is work and your health too. Um, again, stress about it, or this is females, but I do see also for some of you, there could be some good energy coming through. Maybe you hear some good news from your mother or a sister or a female in your life. But for some of you, this could be certain situations that bothered you about them. It's like it's leaving again. Okay, so it's either way here. I don't know how else to explain it. I do see some recognition coming through as well. So that's looking good. Um, health, abundance. Um, okay, I said health, so good. That would be good. But I see home, abundance, fruition, building upon your foundation is really coming through here very strongly. Um, questioning some things. This is like secrets. <laughs> Again, I'm seeing a lot, a lot, a lot of that energy. Okay, business focused as well. And your health and well-being is coming up. Okay, now I see that... Um, success but i see that you may feel like taking some kind of a risk okay and this could be with this either what you've been working on or this intuition or the secret of uh, investigate i don't know something like that showing up but for most of you it's advisable to take a break okay modesty also do everything in moderation is very important as well um so that is really coming up very strongly again i see the central energy um, there's going to be almost a turnaround coming later on to recognition coming through too. And almost it's like some lessons learned or things that you've learned information coming through as well. Coming to an end of a cycle is coming through as well. So I'm seeing that a lot of that energy coming through. Okay. Magical type of energy too. Mystical. I don't know. I don't know how else to explain this. Okay. But anyway, um, Scorpio, that was your reading for the week ahead of March 25th through the 31st. Um, I usually post videos on Fridays. That's the weeklies, but I will be posting my monthly, April monthly readings, gemstone readings on Wednesday. So you could um, look out for that. I hope you have a wonderful week and I'll catch you back next week for your next coffee cup reading. Until then, all the best and bye for now.